Hello Youtubers, I'm Parways and this is our 13th video in Python GUI development with PyQt5. In the previous video, we have learned how you can create a two-line edit in PyQt5 with a return pressed signal. So you can see that this was from my uh, previous video and uh, uh, in this video I want to show you how you can create a button group in PyQt5. Uh, I have created a new Python file at uh, name of Q button group and I will copy some codes from my previous video. So uh, let me first copy the imports because uh, I don't uh, want this, I don't want to write this again. After that, let me create class uh, window and let me just change this to Q widget. So I'm going to use a Q widget and it inherits from Q widget. Now I'm going to write the uh, constructor. Okay, after this, I'm going to just copy uh, these uh, because I need to this and let me paste it. Change the title title to PyQt5 uh, Q button group uh, button group. Also, let me uh, also let me copy uh, these because like this, and let me show the window self dot show and also let me create the object of my uh, Q uh, application and uh, Q main window so let me just copy uh, because uh, yeah like this okay now let me just run this if you don't know about this, you can watch my previous videos. So I'm going to run it. You can see now I have a nice window. After this, let me uh, add. Uh, I don't need a Q push button. I need a Q. Yeah, I need a Q push button. Uh, so let me bring it in here. Uh, push button. Also, I need Q button group. Uh, I need a Q H box layout. Uh, also, I need a Q label. Okay, these are the imports that I need. After this, uh, let me uh, in here. Uh, first, I'm going to create an H box layout. H box Q H box layout. And after this, uh, I want to create a button group. A button group self dot button uh, group q button group okay now i have created the button group and uh, now i need three buttons so button q push button let me add uh, python and uh, after this self dot uh, group uh, self dot button group dot add button now I want to add my this button to the button group mm. and the index is one okay uh, also let me add uh, hbox dot add widget I want to add my button one so also you need to set your layout cell dot set layout to which box layout let me run this and after that I will create my two more buttons okay now I have my first button uh, after this I'm going to just copy this because uh, the process is the same and there is no problem so let me just change uh, change this to uh, uh, Java and the index just change index to two. 
and also copy this and let me run it oh sorry I have forgot to change uh, this to, to tree and also let me change the, uh, the text of my push button to C++ okay now I want to run it and uh, Okay, now I have three buttons. Uh, these three buttons are in the button group, so like this. Okay, now also you can uh, set uh, some, uh, if you remember my previous videos, for example, you can add icon for your button that uh, it looks good. Uh, let me just first add um, these icons. After that, uh, I will show you that how you can uh, as you know in button group we have uh, different signals uh, for example we have button clicked uh, we have button pressed we have button toggled uh, I, will, I will show you that how you can uh, uh, connect a slot to your button group signals so first let me just uh, this is easy you can for example you want to set the font of your uh, button so set phone and cute GUI dot Q font and you can add some shrift and the font uh, 50 also you can button dot set icon and cute GUI dot Q icon and you can add your icon name in here so for example python icon dot png and also you can set the size of your icon, set icon size, uh, you can uh, cute core, I need to import cute core, so from PyQt5 import cute uh, core, I think I don't need to this uh, correct, okay, now uh, Uh, cute core dot uh, Q size and you can give size 40 by 40 and let me run it okay now you can see I have uh, like this button let me just copy this uh, I want to add these for my all buttons uh, there is no problem uh, just change this to uh, java.png also copy it to this and I change this to cpp.png now let me run it okay now you can see we have three buttons now I want to show you how you can uh, uh, connect uh, your button group to the uh, uh, button clicked signal uh, so for this uh, let me create a new uh, function or you can call it method in here so diff on button clicked uh, first before this let me create a label uh, in here and you can create uh, in the section I want to create so let me be import a Q I have imported already so I don't need uh, cell dot label Q label and for right now I just write it write hello now I want to add my label to the edge box so cell dot label and let me run it that's uh, let me pass this let me run Okay, now I have uh, this in here, and also let me set the font of my label at the so smaller. So dot label dot uh, set font mm, cute GUI dot Q font. Mm, it should be fifty. Okay. 
Um, now in here, uh, let me create my uh, this method, or uh, let me create a for a loop for button in self dot button group dot buttons, and also let me create a f f button is uh, in self dot button. Uh, group dot button and you can add an ID in here so let me add also an ID parameter in here ID because uh, you can uh, the signals you can uh, I have said that there are different signals for example button click signal you can uh, get the button click signal according to an ID or according to your widget so I'm going to give it an ID ID in here and now uh, self dot label dot set text and button and I want to do text of the button mm, class was clicked okay uh, now I have created this After this, uh, I'm uh, now well, uh, find uh, your button group. Now this is my button group. In here, I want to connect this. So self dot button group. Now the signal is button clicked. You can see we have button pressed, we have button released, we have button toggle. But uh, for this, I'm using button clicked. And uh, I want to add int. I want to connect this with my cell dot on button clicked okay now this is uh, my complete code uh, you can see uh, now I'm going to run this hopefully I don't get any error okay uh, also let me uh, remove my hello from the label like this okay now I'm going to run it <coughs> if I click on Python Python was clicked and uh, also let me just why uh, Python was clicked uh, okay now Python was clicked, Java was clicked, C++ was clicked. Uh, so this was our button group. Uh, I will add the source code to the video description. If you have any question, please let me know. And for the further videos, don't forget subscription of my channel.